first principle, originalism, for Curtis, and we do believe that our original founder in Curtis 1.0, Glenn, Glenn Hammond Curtis, was a first principle originalist. Essentially what it means is that you go back to the blackboard and you erase everything. And you, you start from scratch. The decisions, the judgment based upon proven experience that has gone into the creation of this motorcycle has been nigh on perfect. We have the one, the ultimate launch vehicle, and we do have a portfolio follow-on, all running modular, proven, superior in every way technology. Now, the one is not a motorcycle. It's an architectural platform for the future of Curtis motorcycles for as far as the eye can see. There is one big fact about this bike that is the most important, and that is that it is dead centered and symmetrical, and it changes everything. Bicycles are not balanced. They never were. So when you're riding a bike and you're doing this and a bike going all over the place, you've got two wheels not balanced. And this Curtis One and all of the Curtis motorcycles, which will modularly use the platform architecture of the One, will have the most perfect state of balance that any rider has ever felt on two wheels in history. That's a fact. And when you're on it, you feel that. And it's easy, and it's light, and it's filled with sublime fidelity. All the information is exceedingly precise and easy to comprehend and to understand. It's incredibly smooth. The original working title for this motorcycle was the RCX, the Rider-Centered Experimental. The whole idea is to build a motorcycle that can be whatever you want it to be. The goal is to, for the motorcycle to adapt to the rider. You can put the motorcycle wherever you want it to be, and you can do it naturally, intuitively. When I ride this motorcycle, I, f I feel like I'm riding the one. I think I speak for the whole team. If we weren't going to do this in an originalist way, then I don't believe we would be following our heart. I don't believe the inspiration would be right. I don't think we would be on cadence, which we are. And I don't think you could have an outcome like the one.